Bonjour, c'est Virginie, and you are watching French Truly TV, your destination to truly become a little bit French. When your native language is English, French conjugation is difficult, or at least tedious, because there's so much to memorize. Every tense is different, every ending is different, sometimes they even look like different words entirely. It's frustrating! So, I have something really good for you that I use with my students. It makes French verbs a lot easier. Six tips that you can learn once and for all and then you keep reapplying. If you missed last week's part one video, go watch it now and then come back to this one. Vous êtes prêts? Remember from last week, there are three groups in French conjugation. The first group, le premier groupe, is for regular verbs ending in er. For example, aimer, to love. The second group, le deuxième groupe, is for regular verbs ending in ir. For example, choisir, to choose. The third group, troisième group, is for all the other verbs, the irregular verbs. Oof. Remember these three groups throughout the video, it will help you. Tip numéro 4. The tenses for future and conditional look almost the same and follow the same logic. Here's how you build them. Take the whole infinitive, remove nothing. Then add the relevant endings. Future endings are a, 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 un, e, un. Conditional endings are e, 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 yon, ye, e. I will love. The infinitive is aimer, add the ending e, j'aimerais. I would love, the infinitive is aimer, add the ending e, j'aimerais. They will choose. The infinitive is choisir, add the ending on, ils choisiront. They would choose. The infinitive is choisir, add the ending e, ils choisiraient. Note that this tip only applies to the regular groups. The first group and the second group, not the third. I will go. The infinitive is aller, but you say j'irai. It doesn't follow the rule because aller belongs to the third group. Tip numéro 5. The endings of the imparfait and the conditional are the same. Yay! Exactly the same. E, 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 yon, ye, e. Only of course the root is different. But now you only have to remember one set of endings instead of two. I loved, j'aimais, I would love, j'aimerais. I chose, je choisissais, I would choose, je choisirais. Tip numéro 6. First and second groups are easier to work with because they are regular. Third group is not. So you don't feel too overwhelmed, here's a short list of third group verbs that are very commonly used. In other words, make sure you memorize these because they are a little funky. Être, to be. Avoir, to have. Faire, to do. Dire, to say. Pouvoir, to be able to. Aller, to go. Voir, to see. Savoir, to know. Vouloir, to want. Venir, to come. Falloir, to have to. Devoir, to have to. Croire, to believe. Prendre, to take. Mettre, to put. Tenir, to hold. Entendre, to hear. Répondre, to respond. Connaître, to know. Attendre, to wait. Vivre, to live. Sortir, to go out. Comprendre, to understand. Devenir, to become. Écrire, to write. I'm adding a link to this blog post, Le Bécherel, where you can enter any of these verbs to obtain the full conjugation. On the link, make sure to click on the tab Temps Composé to see the passé composé. You like this video, you found it helpful, now you want more. Subscribe. If you missed last week's video, Six Tips for Easy French Conjugation Part 1, click here. This was your French friend Virginie helping you become a little bit French. Merci beaucoup. Au revoir.